life is crazy, man. Mm-hmm. Brings you into all different kinds of fucked up places, or sometimes into great places. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I know. <laughs> At the like, end of the day, you want to know something? Every goal of every religion is to have eternal life. Mm-hmm. They follow the Torah because they feel like there's a life after this. They follow the Quran because they feel like there's a life after this. They follow the Bible because they feel like it's a life after this. You're right. So they follow all these books and all of these um, mm-hmm. religions Scripture. and all of these faiths because they're looking for eternal life. Mm-hmm. And this right here is the truth. This right here, blood over intent, heaven on earth. This is the truth. Your blood makes atonement for your sins and there you go. You feel like, as we all been told, Mm-hmm. So it's just like, why not find that habit on us? Why not make it? And if you don't believe in it, shit, it only takes about five minutes to do it, you know? Why not just do it and then get it over with and just sit it back since you don't believe it so much? You no, know? <laughs> it won't hurt you. It ain't gonna hurt you. It ain't gonna hurt nobody else if you don't believe it, right? Right. Hey, hey man, at least you know you're, you're in the book of life sarcastically, whether you believe it or not, you know, like... At least you know that your name is somewhere and you can possibly be given eternal life if it is factual, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Why not take a chance? Right. You know? It's like um putting your dollar in a in a in a donation box or, or a charity fund. You you give a dollar to the BK uh, BK people at the register or at the cash register. Nine times out of ten that dollar ain't going to where you think it's going. <laughs> it's going right back into the motherfucking register. You feel me? Yeah, or right back into their pocket. You did. You know? So at the end of the day, it's just like, but you'll still have that good faith in you. Like, I hope this goes to someone who needs it, and you'll still put it there. You know, yeah. like things like that, man. Like, hey, we can only hope, we can only hope for the best. That's right, bro. Well, we're all here. Just that's what I mean. We're here to just make this a better place, and that's what makes blood over intent what it is. Yeah. So that's what it is. If you you just got to take a chance. And in life, you take plenty of chances doing other things. You take chances believing other faiths or listening to other things. And, you know. Yeah, we got two ears and one mouth for a reason. Body and shit like that. So it's just like, why not? Why not just one job? Cut a little boo-boo or fucking pin, whatever. Peel a scab. Even if you got to do it yourself. You feel either way, it's just one job. He ain't asking you to commit suicide or slice your wrist. It's one drop against your intentions. Your written intentions, one drop. There you go, you're all finished. It's oh like a video that's like hours and hours and hours. Just upload a video that's short, like a few seconds, you know? Like, it doesn't have to be like, you know, like 16 seconds. It can be 10, you know? Like, just make a short video, you know? It's, Some people just don't get the gist of it. Until it becomes a popular thing and other people start talking about, you know how it is. Yeah. We'll be ignored. We'll, we'll only a selected few will want to join. But once they see their buddies or their friends or all their people is joining it, now they're gonna want to join. Now they're oh shit, maybe I should make. You feel? Know, once they see a girl they like or or their best friend or a someone certain they look up person, to join it, right? Now, it's like a chain it. reaction. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's what Similar I mean. to our it's like it's just like same thing with like your fire. guys's videos like if you guys wake up one person that you're gonna change not only that person's life but you're gonna change like their whole family's life you're gonna change everybody around them's life if you just like literally touch one person right. you know it's like you teach a man how to fish or you're gonna give a man a fish mm-hmm. you teach him how to fish so they're always gonna look up to you they'll, they'll be eating forever if you right. give him a fish he only eats that one time right you feel so you always want to teach a man how to fish and not just give him a fish mm-hmm. you feel like yeah. the best I teacher think. is somebody that's not only gonna you know they'll tell you and show you but they're gonna let you do it too you know they're gonna tell you and show you how to do it but they're gonna let you do it but you you can lead a horse to water but you can't make it drink you know i can't do your blood over intent for you you know like i tell him like you heard me tell kurt last night you know the little video i sent right he was in his garage and i was telling him you know it's serious shit i can't fucking do it for you you know and he just laughed it off yeah you can't do it for everyone you know, you can't do it for no one at all, but your loved ones and your close ones or people who doesn't have the advantage to do it for self, you know? Mm-hmm. Um, but 
yeah, it really is just about pride and ego. Sometimes people just gotta put that pride and aside. Everybody just does you shit because their family did it, ego. and their family did it, and then everybody else's family did it. And it's like, yes, we all fucking know this. <laughs> uh, Hindsight is twenty twenty, uh, motherfucker. But you know, uh, re legion. Everybody's re, re gonna redo it. <laughs> Makes sense. Yeah, I do, bro. I do. Kane, I don't know if you have any time, but I kind of wanted to talk to you about some uh, shit we were talking about the other night. I was going to need some research and shit. And I wanted to find Let me know. It. Yeah, because I know you have a little experience with it, and you have an idea better than I do, you know? And I just need, I mean, I know, but I just, I like other people's insight too, you know? And like... I'm all ears, man, anytime. Yeah, you're the right, you're, you know. you're my kind of, yeah, you're, you're my dude I need to speak on this shit with, you know? Mm. I, like, I had this certain thing I did to deal with, with you with, but I was just waiting until the timing was right, you dig? I wasn't going to go bother you with what I needed. Right. Yeah. Nah, you don't bother me whatsoever, man. Sure, I consider you all my friends, to be honest with you. Friends, you're brother. Yeah, really, don't be people I talk to every day. I talk to you all more than my baby mama. Right, I know, right, right. Yeah, my baby mama's locked up right now, which sucks, cause. Yeah, man. Yeah, but I talk to her on the phone. I talk to her on the phone and keep, keep her head up and shit. You know, she's just having a hard time. She's she got put away yeah. for something that was, you know. But right. It, it's just it's that's the way it is. Like I tell her, you know, like some people get put away for a month for what she did, but she got fucking hammered for what she did and. Uh, not much we can do outside of, uh, of it, you know, and other than just try to keep her positive and focused. And right. she did her she did her blood over intent while she was locked up, you know, which was awesome. And she's a real one. For you that. can tell she's waking up in there, man. She's pretty crazy. She's a goddess, you know. And like we were just speaking, goddess worship is key. And you need to worship the goddess and keep worshiping the goddess. And I worship all women. Mm -hmm. That's what Egypt was about. That's yeah. how they yeah. um, worship the Ankh. If you look at that cross, yeah, they the had the circle. Yeah, uh, the life. It the was, worship women. Yeah, it was the... Because even when you say there's a man in the sky, where did that man come from? Symbol of life. Right. And like I was just telling Joshua that they took that Ankh symbol, right? Which was the symbol of life, or the ink. And uh, they, they it look it showed the two, the womb on it on that uh, like on that on, on that ink it shows the womb up top and then it shows like yeah. you know and that's what we're in is like the womb and uh, it's the woman it's the god it shows that uh, God is a woman and uh, it also shows that uh, they took that the, the ink and they converted it into a cross which yeah. every. And now yeah, with, they broke the circle off. Yeah. Just kept across. Yeah, and which is the unfolded cube, you know? And then they totally inverted it. Like, now you gotta worship the dead Jesus character, which is the father, the, the masculinity. You, now you gotta worship that instead of worshiping the goddess and the divinity, which is key. Yeah, that's different. I haven't I haven't looked much into the cube theory. So, uh, right. I hear about it all the time. Man. I just I keep it around. I leave it alone, kind of, because right. it, it 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 it, uh, it derives. When I did look into it, it, it really derived from a lot of the what shit is that, that I was looking into. The cube theory. Just right, dude. You gotta talk to Joshua about that, cause man, he's on a whole nother level when it comes to that shit. Like, dude, he's talking about like we're a cube inside of a cube, and you know, it's just it's wild. And then plus, when you when we die, we get outside the cube, but then they're gonna try to sucker us to get back inside the cube. Yeah, but that's the, they say that's the same thing no matter what shape. They right. Believe in a round right. Or yeah. They say that for everything. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just, yeah, by, they, they I just Saturn, go by. I just go by my the Saturn matrix, right. the Saturn moon matrix, and the moon matrix. Yeah, I mean, so it's just like, mm -hmm. wait, wait. There's certain conspiracies that I. It's like a never-ending story. So those are the conspiracies I leave alone. To be honest with you, because I'm like, yo, this shit never ends. Like, there's no. You know, 
there's no summary with there's no wrap it up there's no solution or conclusion it's just that it just is what it is you feel me so i'm just like yeah it's, it's all there's no really like evidence based it's all you know just idealistic because there are a few cubes in this world but you can say the same thing about um they have these other things around that they find everywhere there's these little things that hindus pray to so um it's like this little knob it looks like a knob right and it got this little circle around like a ring mm-hmm. you feel like let's say it brings a lot of luck and stuff like that and they got one in washington they got one in america and they're like how does that even get in america why is it even in washington dc mm-hmm. if, if it's hinduism so um i look into that more than i do into a cube bro because the cube is only used like about three times around the this country and it's only like for decorational purpose from what they say man I think hmm. it's probably like one religion that looks at the cube as like but they say that was like a home of I don't know if it was Allah or Vishnu it was one of them so, okay. I don't know yeah it's it's that definitely was, yeah it's crazy bro cause that's how I need Josh to like really, really elaborate. Yeah, yeah. So it's like, good. Yeah, we. I just found out too. Like he has to pay money to be in these chats because he he's running out data. So I was like, man, you need to, we need to figure out something, you know, to where we can get you in here and chat with you. Like he's got to get some Wi-Fi, you know. And we got to figure out. Right. And I know our bro- our brother Lemio too. Like Infinity, he's got the same issue, you know. He can't come in. Where's he in like? He's in, he's he's like in an old different yeah right yeah yeah right. you nailed it and it right. sucks and but like I was telling Joshua I'm like dude there's got to be a way we can connect all of us without it costing anything you know like this is ridiculous it shouldn't cost us a dime I would say Zoom but yeah regardless of what plan you got it's gonna cost you data you gotta right. pay for your internet yeah that's why i told him you just gotta get internet bro figure it out but i mean either way you don't you don't have to but if you want to connect with these chats and, and get at least some fucking like sense into your brains you know people like need to get some kind of sense into their brains instead of just brain constantly brainwashing themselves you know that's all they do is brainwash brainwash brain i mean i did a lot too which is i'm fucking retarded now because of it but we don't get it in our own ways i don't know anything we all believe strongly in something that we once was too naive to look back on or or turn our back to like because we were so into it but yeah, man, you get convinced otherwise. When there's too much evidence to show you otherwise, man, you know, it's it'll only be pride that's holding you back. Because you're like, damn, after all this fucking work, man, this shit's... I ain't letting this shit go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. say they make 14 videos calling a certain rapper a snitch, and then you find out that rapper didn't snitch. Are you going to make the video that says he didn't snitch, or are you going to keep promoting the ones that no. you, you was talking about? Mm-hmm. And nine times out of ten, they just promote the same bullshit that they was doing before they found out they won't even tell you the truth mm-hmm. so, so it, should, it, it happens man some people don't like being corrected it's almost like with religious aspects like just like when I talk to certain people about religion and shit like yo unless you can talk to me unbiasedly and you're willing to step out of your religious box I don't want to talk to you mm-hmm. and I'll, I'll keep it straight up it's, I, I, I'm, I'm not a debate when it comes to that whole debate shit I'll debate with you but I won't argue with you I don't argue I swing hands that's my biggest problem in this world. That's why I'm alone today. Hello, my house. I'm, I'm alone in the house. I mean, like, same, bro. Reason, I, left, I left my I left people alone for a reason. Like anyone, mm-hmm. I, I pushed out of my life because I pushed them out before it got physical. Yeah, I feel yeah, like yeah, yeah, I feel you. And it, that's, that's the type it's of person called, I am. It's like, called you know, boundaries. Bad, bad it's called boundaries. You know how to set boundaries, right. and you don't know how, you know not to cross them boundaries. Right. So that's that's basically all it is. But like, that's good, bro. Yeah, we should all be right. able to set boundaries, man. We should all set boundaries, you know, because without setting boundaries, you're just gonna be out of control, you know. And at least you have control over this shit. Without setting boundaries, you're susceptible to people's frustration to to impose on you. So now, as mad as they are, they'll make you just as disappointed and angry. So and you sometimes you don't want to react on them, so you keep all that shit. You have to in. set some boundaries. You start breaking shit around the yeah. house. You saw fucking with your own mind you yeah. feel shit like that like you have to I don't do that. 
I just cut people off. I've right. been cutting people off for a long time. Right, you just have yeah, to sit block boundaries. Block list is crazy. If I show you my block list on Facebook, you'll be like, damn, how the fuck do you even know that many people to block? <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, 